Oh, Nitro. We got a thousand points for Nitro. Are you kidding me? I'm going to throw up. I'm going to throw up. We're getting ready to throw up. Okay. Everyone, welcome back to the crew to jumping in to do more races amongst the streets of the United States, even though it's a much more condensed version and very small, but still we're in the United States. God damn it. Uh, we're going to be in here in the Hellcat. This is, I guess, a pretty goddamn good replica of mine. Uh, I have a 2018 Hellcat myself. The only thing that is definitely not the same is the fucking engine noise that you hear in this game versus what you would hear in real life, which is definitely a bummer. Uh, let's not be you know, too nice to the crew too when they very simply could have done some really good uh, audio work for this game, but they decided not to, so that's fine. Uh, so the last time we got in this game, we did some, I don't know the last difficulty name, but we I would say extreme professional. I guess we'll just go with professional there. Uh, we did some professionals. I also did some drifting, which we kind of sucked again on uh, the whole drifting thing, even though I had it for that one episode. So it's kind of unfortunate to see it go <laughs> as quick as it came, I guess, uh, which is always good. So we're going to start off with some races to here today. I'm sorry, some races to here today. I'm just making up my own language up in this bitch. Oh, that's someone else. He's drifting. He's drifting. See a bitch. See a bitch. See a bitch. You just hit a wall. You suck. I'm just kidding. You're, you're good at this game. Uh, so we're going to get started with some races today. I don't know if we're going to do a uh, hard difficulty professional. I'm not sure exactly what's going to be the, uh, the, M mm, the MO for today. Uh, but we'll go ahead and see. Let's go ahead and get it popping. Oh, that was photo mode. I always do this in the game. I always open fucking photo mode. And that's not what I fucking mean to do every time. Uh, what is it? This one? It is. All right. Let's back it up. Let's see where we're at. I want to say we're in uh, LA. Okay. That is correct. We are. So where do we want to go? What about up north? Like mid, mid west north. Is, hmm? is that? That's not accurate. <laughs> the Midwest north, huh? What the fuck are you saying? Uh, so let's see. We got a stage two west rally raid here. Uh, that looks to be fairly big. Let's, uh, let's not lie. We've got another one there. Relatively smaller. Yellowstone Special Rally Cross. I'm not seeing anything on the distance, which is a little bit odd, but I wouldn't mind doing some snow. Let's, let's be honest here. So let's switch it up a little. Uh, let's see what car we are able to use in this race. Because if it changes, it'll change instantly. Oh, that. I can use that. Well, let me look. Hold on. I want to see what else I can use. Okay, fantastic. That's a goddamn selection if I've ever seen it right there, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get this uh, party started. Yellowstone National Park race. God only knows what this is going to be like. It's definitely going to be some off-road stuff. Let's take a swig of that iced tea. Mm. I had two seconds to do so. What, 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 what? Let's go. It looks like it's going to be... Oh. Oh. Oh, fuck. The West mm. number two is this is toxic. Yeah, woo, Yellowstone Park, already off to an absolute fucking shitty start, dude. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, I still see the objective. We had a very bad start. I'm going to blame it on the iced tea, okay? We're just going to go ahead and say, fuck you, iced tea. Probably its fault. Oh my god, when you look over for... Okay, you know what we're doing? We're just going to restart this one because I done fucked up, Johnny. I had done fucked. Oh, we're still just sliding. We're still just sliding down this fucking thing, dude. That's when you know you fucked up. All right. So that was just a warm up. I wanted to see if you guys were paying attention. I'm glad everyone is paying attention here because uh, that was fucking horrible. All right. Off top. No bullshit. I've changed my camera angle, too. There we go. Special number two. Uh, special number two. Yellowstone Park. Geysers. I'll show you bursting geysers. Okay. I'm going to be honest here, guys. This is the worst car to be using on a uh, track like this. Like, absolutely just fucking horrible. That it, it's really not even funny. And it's kind of sad, considering the fact that I only had one option. And this dude is right on the six. So we've got to kind of really slow down for the braking here. Or we are shooting right off this. Also, paying attention to the track in front of me would be a damn good idea, as we just saw prior. Because if not, somebody going to die up in this bitch. Oh, shit. Okay, we're still good. We've got a uh, decent lead. I wouldn't say it's too much. Maybe six car lengths from the uh, objective here. I am getting some drifting going on, but I think that's more just because the vehicle is sliding instead of me actually drifting like a professional here. Okay, that was professional. Professional. Holy shit, I think that might have just helped us get a decent lead on this guy. 
Obviously, we've still got to make sure we pay attention because one little fuck up can really just end and fuck up our day here. I do like this track. We're 25% completed. We're a minute and 14 seconds in. So it uh, it's relatively long. Let's be honest here. I like how they didn't show me prior, which is kind of stupid. I always like to see how long of a race I'm uh, kind of going here going here for. Oh, shit. This is, this is sketchy. There's definitely a difference in what we're feeling when it comes to driving on pavement versus dirt here. And I really don't know if I'm liking it. It's uh, kind of sketchy, kind of scary all around. You know what I mean? We still got a decent lead. I see him on the little small uh, mini map there. So I'm feeling confident. We got some really sharp turns coming on. Oh, oh, somebody going to die. Oh, okay. We didn't miss it. We didn't miss it. I thought we missed it there. We, we hit like the uh, barrier for it. So I was kind of thinking we done fucked up, Johnny. But we're looking to be good right now. Six seconds ahead of the uh, other racer there, if I believe I'm reading that correctly. They never really told me what that meant. I'm kind of just taking a guess here. I, I would assume that's my lead time. I'm six seconds and 6.74 seconds ahead. Well, now 44, but you know what they say. You can't win them all. Oh, okay. We're getting a little all over the place. We're a little choppy right now. I, I got to dial it down. We're 53% completed. So we are... Oh, shit. Okay, get it together. Get it together. Okay, we're good. Okay, we still got a lead on this guy. We got a three-second lead time on him. That's not the best. Oh, fuck, man. This is the worst car. The... Oh, no, no. Back up. Oh, that's fucking grimy. That's grimy, dude. He's got a car that's actually meant for the dirt. I'm over here in, like, a fucking banana on a slip and slide with oil on it. Just makes zero sense. Like, come on. I got to get me an off-road car. We are we have a one-second lead time from the uh, second racer that's in this. Oh, just fantastic. All right, coming up on 68% here. Feeling confident. I'm, I'm thinking we're going to be able to pull this off here. I would assume we're going to have to either beat this guy or beat a time here. Uh, but they did not give me that time to beat, so I don't know what it is exactly. So it's kind of just... It's all up in the air. I think it's just winning the race at this point, and then after that, we focus on anything else that we have to. Oh, shit. Somebody gonna die today. Okay, checkpoint. We are 78% completed. We got some mini straightaways here. Not too bad. Able to make do. I got a nice, decent lead time on this other racer. Now looking at 83% completed with 3 minutes and 57 seconds left on the clock. And uh, somehow we've able to pull a pretty decent lead from this other guy who's also competing with us. Not too much damage, but we've, we've had had some scary moments here, uh, which is definitely not good. I can only imagine this being on, like, medium uh, difficulty. Probably wouldn't be the most fun, but you know what they say. I'm definitely down to try it, but I don't want to try it until we get a car that's worthy of uh, going on the track. Seven second lead time. That's, that's pretty beautiful there, although we are losing control pretty badly. Eight second lead time. We're only gaining on this guy. And we're going to be coming up to the uh, finish line here. Yep. Here we go, baby. Let's just take it home. I'm pretty sure it's going to be me because homie is not anywhere even close to be able to continue racing with me. But you know what they say. I liked how you tried to give him a sliver of uh, hope there. A little, little bit of help. That is not how it's going to work. All right. Going to swoop that loot really quick. Uh, we're probably going to get some upgrades to this vehicle as well, which is always good. The more vehicles uh, we upgrade, the more options and stuff we have where we won't get our ass kicked every single time we go into a race with a vehicle besides the Hellcat. The Hellcat can just do its own perfectly without any issues at all. So that wasn't bad. I got to admit, that was a decent race. Um, we've seen a lot worse. Uh, we had a very sketchy first attempt there, uh, but we got back into it. Don't worry. We just had to give a little bit of a restart. So uh, let's find something else that we can get into. Why does this one look so crazy? Is this going to be some like off the wall fucking thing here that we've done before in this game where it's like a normal yeah that is okay well glad we established that so quick fucking a hmm what the fuck was that man i was drinking my iced tea and all of a sudden he's doing donuts i'm by myself Twenty thousand points off the rip oh 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 holy shit okay we got this starting it off strong 65 points you already know what's up backflip immediately bro backflip fucking immediately That one was close, but we, we took it home. We took it home, goddammit. All right. 5,000 points have already been earned. I feel like I'm going to break through this shit. We're going to pop another fucking backflip because why the fuck not? 
That's literally only uh double backflip that bitch. Oh, that's what I'm talking about right there. Hell yeah. They better give me a double backflip fucking uh you know bonus, I guess, if that's a fucking thing. I don't I don't know if it is or not. Uh, why did I go through here? Oh, precision. Precision. Give me those points, bro. Give me those points for precision. Uh, let's see. We've got three minutes. That's a long time. We're almost halfway there. Unless I just did 20 times better this, uh, this time around. Who knows? Maybe. I would say I did. Let me go through and not get killed here. Oh, hell yeah. We're doing it, bro. Hell yeah. Oh, Nitro. We got a thousand points for Nitro. Are you kidding me? I'm going to throw up. I'm going to throw up. We're getting ready to throw up. Okay. Fantastic. Okay, I don't think I'm going to be able to perform a backflip on this, but I'm going to try to get as many as I can there. We're at 13,000 points. Wants me to go through some doors and not the others. Precision. That's what I like. Give me those precision points, man. That's just cheaty-ass points right there. Oh, no, no 1,000 for Nitro? That's fucking bullshit. I want more points. All right, we got 5,000 points to go. That's actually not bad. This is probably one of the easiest things that we've done in this game in quite some time. Which, how did I miss that? Which is kind of nice. Give me another backflippy thing in a jiggy, okay? That's what I want to do. I want to go upside down. All right, we got a checkpoint up here. I'm going to go up here. Give me precision. As long as we go through and get precision, we should be good. Oh, coming through hot, bro. We're skirting this, bitch. Okay, I see another loop de loop. Oh, we can other. Okay, this one gave me a thousand points last time when we hit it with the nitro. Whew, looping. Come on, nitro, nitro, nitro. You didn't give me the thousand for nitro. I want all my money back. Please, guarantee, no bullshit. Oh, oh. We just went through that bitch. Didn't even mean to, but I'll take it. 17,000 points. We got a minute and 23 seconds left. Maybe I should get a wheelie in here. Objective complete. Damn, we just crushed that shit. What was it? The really? Uh, what? The really? <laughs> the really? Not the really what? That made zero sense. Okay, well, we absolutely crushed that shit, dude. That was fucking... That was easy as shit. Now we just got to reach the uh, end in a minute. I should say fuck the points and just start focusing on trying to get to the uh, end here. I wanted to do it. Oh. Oh, damn. Okay, uh, that one hurt. I did not land it the way I thought I was going to land. We kind of landed sideways there and insta-killed the dude. So I apologize for all the people who weren't expecting to see him just die right there. All right, let's get up this bitch nice and quick. We got 91% left on this. I'm sorry, 92% completed with 33 seconds. Oh, shit, we actually got to hurry, dude. We don't have much time. I'm going to do the uh, nitrous glitch. Double back, double back, double back. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Hell yeah. 27 at the end. Hell fucking yeah, dude. Fuck, that was a little scary, I gotta admit. We did die a few times, but that was a fun course. That was definitely a fun fucking course right there. Uh, 27,000 out of 20,000 points that were required of us. We had point uh, points, crate, 57, jump, 868 meters. That's, that's not too bad, I gotta admit. That was pretty fun, though. Oh, I didn't get my loot, and it returned me to free roam. That's fucking shitty, dude. What? Oh, there we go. I got it. Okay, good. I was going to say, that's toxic. All right, let's jump into another one. We got Take 2 Rally Cross here. I don't know why I'm going with so many Rally Crosses. This is quite interesting. Let's see what other cars we got in our lineup. Zero. Okay, we're going with the GT fucking ARP in this bitch. Because why the fuck not? It's a beautiful car. It's just, I don't think it's appropriate for every motherfucking race that we do. But I guess that's that's just me. Let's get some iced tea in here while it shows us the same shit it showed us 30 times. Okay, well, that's a new fucking little starting thing. Oh, come on. What am I, the point machine, the point box, the fucking... The wind me up and point me out? Holy shit. I, I went around the crates, lols. Uh, perfect landing. I want some more perfect landings if you guys are going to give me a motherfucking shit like that. Okay, decent, decent, decent. I'm trying to go for as many crates as possible here, but it's it's not working. I don't know why they put three if you really can't get them unless you, like, drift in them. Oh, okay. We're up to 2,000. We got to get 20,000 points again. You got me fucked up. I feel like that would have been a lot easier with something that you could do a backflip on uh, versus a car. Oh, we're getting reckless, bro. I'm missing a lot of crates up in this bitch. Okay. Boom, boom. Thank you, ma'am. 
I'm gonna just try to get... I think crates is gonna be the only way we can go with this. Unless it gives me precision. Oh, for going through that. Precision! Only 250 you got me fucked up. I, what is that? Uh, why are you gonna give me a thousand points for precision last time? Son of a bitch. Why are they on the rack? Uh, the rack? Why are you on the rack? Why are you on the racetrack? Holy shit. Get the fuck off it, bro. It's a near miss. Oh, yeah. They do it. Oh, I see. So you can kind of... Uh, Oh, you can cheat the system. Oh. You got to get super close, though. That was an actual hit. That was not a miss. That was a hit. Oh, my new Damn, son. Boom. And boom. And okay, we're going to miss that one. That's fine. That's 250 per those. Uh, unlike the crates, which are just 100, because obviously that's a cheeky bullshit way. Yeah, don't fucking... Why don't you put up some barriers up in this bitch? No, I'm not lost. I'm just trying to figure it all out, man. All right, we got some here. I'm missing a lot, but I also don't want to, like, totally fuck up the car, because that would be kind of fucked. Okay, we got to go for these precisions if possible. All right, let me get some nitrous. Go ahead. Oh, you can get near misses for everything, bro. Even regular cars. Oh, a little bit of destruction right there. Hell yeah. 11,000. We've got 1 minute and 47 seconds on the clock. Using that night. Oh, Jesus. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, okay. That was the weirdest shit I've ever seen in my fucking life. What the fuck? Was that was worse than GTA would do it. Oh, my God. Holy shit. The physics left the world for a second. That was toxic. All right. Let me get that precision. Oh, hell yeah. That was a clean drift, bro. We got a minute 19 on the clock for us to be able to swoop this shit up like nobody's business. Are we going to be able to do it? I don't know. I feel like I want to go with near uh, misses. Close call. We touched that one. Son of a bitch. We're at 17,000, bro. 17,000. Come on. One minute left. One minute. Bam. 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 Okay, we're gonna get a precision then, fuck it. Okay, I, I think I'm slowly starting to understand all the different ways that you can make points in this. Oh yeah, objective completed on the drift too. That's what I'm talking about, dude. Let me have it, oh shit. I love when I almost hit 420 points. No, that's lame. Oh, oh we can bust through it. Watch out, holy shit. All right, we did, we're doing good on these. I don't understand how we're doing this good. But I would say we're definitely doing a lot better than we had any other time. That's fucking for sure. Uh, 6,250 points in crates. Drift, 2,700. Jump, 2,615. So, not bad. Um, but we, you know, I think as time goes on and we play those more, it won't be as bad. I feel like before it was just so shitty and redundant that I really didn't understand what I was supposed to be doing. And it was just like driving fast and hitting crates. Now I realize there's so many things. Did I get Icon? What? Wants us to be the oh, pros. hold on. Shot newcomers wanted Icon care. up in this bit. Oh my God. That now, just go made all of my shit so populated on the map. Hey, we got some stuff in Washington up there. We're going to have to check it out and see what we got. That's uh, pretty interesting. We just unlocked hella shit. I am seeing new symbols that I haven't seen. The map looks ridiculously crazy at this point. 99 new activities just got added to our board. That's what's up. There is literally going to be no ending this game. As soon as we start making dents in like the uh, progress, it, I feel like we just get set right back up in this bitch. Wow. You're so famous, bro. That is factual, I would feel like at this point. There's like a lot of fucking dead space in some of these areas, which I guess makes sense, but maybe those come later. But that's a lot of fucking dead space right there. Okay, so what do we got? We got the Cascade Scenic Tour Race. Where is this? gonna be this oh it's gonna be in seattle too interesting that's like the only race that's out there but okay let's go ahead and check it out uh we're gonna travel to this waypoint here and let's see what the uh so seattle race holds i get to use the uh hellcat i want to see what other things oh we got a lot of cars that are available yeah we're gonna do this we're gonna use the fucking hellcat because that is the thing that has the most uh upgrades to it and it also is just a super fast car so fuck it if we're gonna be racing in seattle we might as well do it in the fucking hellcat all right, let's see what this one holds. I don't think I've done this race before, so this is going to be completely brand new, and we're going to be able to see what... Oh, good, it's snowing, too. Fantastic. I can't get away from it ever, it seems like. Just always there. Oh, it's a fucking race with people, too. I'm doing nitrous off the top in the kitty. Let's go. See you, bitches. We'll see you on the other side of this 
is what Washington looks like when it snows. That is gonna be fucking gorgeous. I've never lived in the snow before, so I'm actually kind of curious to see what it's all about and how shitty it's gonna be, but I'm kind of excited. It's something to look forward to, you know what I mean? Okay, so let's focus on this race. We've got 5% completed on it already, 25 seconds in. Uh, we've got a decent lead on these guys. Again, this is the easiest difficulty because you have to win the race and beat it to be able to unlock new difficulty, which is interesting. It would be cool if they just had it to where you could pick one of the three difficulties off the top uh, instead of having to unlock one at each time because basically they're forcing you to play the races three times, possibly even more if you suck ass and you have to redo them. So, yeah, I think it would be cool if they maybe switch that up because I am obviously enjoying the crew too and it just would be nice to see them... Uh, you know, take a switch with it. That way you can just go in there. If you just, if you're feeling confident, might as well just go in there and handle shit really quick in a professional race. And if you kick everyone's ass, you kick everyone's ass. So I don't see the big deal in it. All right. We are at 18% completed. We're at one minute and eight seconds into this. And uh, we have a gorgeous lead on these other racers. I don't see them at all. That's not what I wanted to do. There we go. Uh, yeah, I would say that's a pretty goddamn good lead, especially considering the fact that we're 21% into this race. Uh, for us just wanting to win the first race in Seattle here. Although I don't feel like we started in Seattle. That was Seattle. They dumbed that bitch down intensely. Because I've been there a couple times. And it kind of just gives me San Francisco vibes. Uh, like a lot. And I don't feel like we started there in uh, Seattle. But I digress. That's fine. I understand it's just a game. Uh, but when I drive around in LA in this game. It definitely feels like they nailed it on the head. But I can see how that might be different for some other games in this bitch. All right, moving in. Uh, let's see. We're at 31% completed. Two minutes into this race right now, and I would say we have a damn good lead. The only thing that would fuck this up is uh, my my driving skills, which I would say have gotten progressively better over the you know last five episodes or so, throwing a little bit of drifting in there and all that fun shit. So that's all you can ask for. Just a little betterness, if that's even even a thing or a word. But we'll we'll take it for what it is. Oh, look at that lead. Look at that little mini map. Look at that fucking lead. We're pulling. We are pulling right now. We were going almost 200 in the snow. That's such a deadly fucking recipe to just die. Holy shit, dude. Oh my god, we were going like a 180 there. That's fucking gorgeous. Okay, we have performed a tremendous jump. Nine seconds lead time on these guys. Uh, that is that is very good. So even if we were possibly to fuck up at this point, which we have came very close with these guardrails, uh, we should have enough time to quickly get back into it. And uh, not have it fuck every, you know, our whole run up or anything like that. Oh, we are just whipping it through this shit, dude. We've already made the turn. And these guys are still coming up to the turn. Which this right here is just going to give us the max amount of distance that we can get if we just go. Drive anytime, anywhere. Completed, baby. This is my daily. Yeah, you're goddamn right. I love this car. We're going 203 miles per hour. Holy shit. We have such a fucking lead on these guys. And we're only 62% completed. It seems like we're wrapping back down, uh, like the hills of Washington or something like that. I'm, I don't even think they have hills, to be truthfully honest. But uh, definitely not hills like California, that's for sure. I guess we're just wrapping back through the country of Washington, even though everywhere is the country in Washington. Let's, let's also be honest. Holy shit. We are going 211 downhill, and we're just eating it like it's fucking ice cream, dude. Like it's meant to be fucking eaten. Oh, God. This is so good. Racers say what? I don't know. I can't hear you back there, motherfuckers. 19 second lead time. We can fuck our shit up twice and still be good. Oh, 21 second lead time. We are getting better and better each time we go through these checkpoints. 22. 22, baby. That wasn't even a checkpoint. That's okay. 22 on the clock. That's what I'm talking about. 85% completed. We are going through what looks to be a little town somewhere. Very, very small town. I don't even know the name, nor can I open the fucking map, so... Looks like we're all going to be in the unknown in this bitch. I wonder how well they did the, uh, you know, scaling or just, like, the detail of uh, everywhere besides, like, major places like New York, California, uh, Texas. Places that, you know, are so big that it's easy to get the landmarks down. I haven't really traveled much to be able to identify. Damn, already at the finish line. Coming up on it. We've been racing for a little less than five minutes there. I would say that's fucking solid. And we got fucking first, dude. That had to have been some good time, though. The Hellcat just fucking puts it down. I think we've reached uh, Icon. Whoa! We're going through the Icon so much faster, dude. We're already Icon 2. Hell yeah. 
That's what I'm talking about right there. I don't know how or why we're going through them that quick. Unless it's just they're the lower ranks of the icon, which you kind of go through them fast, which would make sense. Ooh, that was a good race, I gotta admit. So where are we in Washington right now? Let's go ahead and see if we can kind of identify. Oh, we're in, uh, we're, in, we're just outside of Seattle. Okay, that's pretty cool. All right, so it kind of ends. So it's like Canada and no. All right, let's uh, let's go into Seattle and just kind of see what it looks like. They have condensed this tremendously to what the actual size is in real life. But uh, okay, that works. Let's go ahead and see. We'll just head into town here. We'll do a little bit of non-racing activities. Just drive through the fucking streets in the uh, oh, in the Hellcat. If I don't crash and die and kill everyone else around us. Excuse me. Oh, I got a horn. Nice. I like it. Oh, you know what? We're going to take the uh, thumbnail in Seattle out here. That'll be cool. Okay. So let's see how many landmarks I can uh, recognize here, which is probably going to be zero, but you know, we'll try our best. Speed trap. Oh, 188.3. That had to have been... Oh, I completed it. I didn't even... I passively just completed that shit like it was nothing. Okay. Yeah. Nothing really is standing out to me like, oh, that building or a hey, that building. Uh, like at all in any way, shape or form. You'd think they would have like the space needle or something like that, but maybe they didn't put like crazy landmarks in the game. Oh shit, I say that, but look what's behind me, bro. The motherfucking space needle. Holy shit, it's there. All right, well, let's find a uh, picture spot with the space needle here. I did take some uh, explorer shots kind of close to the space needle, almost in a place like this. That's trippy as fuck, bro. That's trippy. Uh, that, why is, oh, that was the actual racer right there. Kind of having fun. Oh, multiple people. All right, we're going to go like right here. And dude, there's so many of them passing. What the fuck is going on? Are they like out all cruising and shit? That's kind of dope. Cruising in Seattle, man. Uh, this is going to be weird. I think I'm going to need to go more up the street because that would be a sick shot. But unfortunately, I am so far or I'm so close to it that I'm not going to be able to get it in frame like I would hope. I mean, we did demolish this race in Seattle here, so might as well get one that stands out with it. So let's go to uh, vehicle damage and all that stuff's on. We're going to go or off. We're going to change the time a little. We're going to make the car look a little more poppy. Kind of just, I don't even know if that's a fucking word, but I mean, that's not bad. I, I can pull from that. We can kind of work with that. You know what I mean? Uh, that's something. I, I just wanted the space needle in the back because I think that, would, that was kind of like a staple of this. Okay, yeah, that'll do. I do like that one. I like the sunset. I think that's going to draw some eyes in right there. All right, let's back up out of this. I can get that. We'll just clip it out of the, uh, the video there. Okay, you're shitting on me, I see. All right, good stuff. So we're not going to do any more races. I might as well just continue kind of just having fun driving around. I can uh, swap out some other cars too. I've opened every menu that I possibly could right now. And all I want to do is just change the camera angle. Fuck my life, right? Okay, there we go. So let's change the vehicle. I'm going to go to something else that we have. Let's do this uh, Mustang Fastback GT. I don't think I have any customizations on it, but it does seem like a fucking nice car. Ooh, that does sound good. All right, let's see. I want to be able to see if there's any other cars that we could possibly start, you know, doing and using for races, kind of just getting that performance level up. We're already going 142. Like, it's not putting down a tremendous amount of power just straight up off the rip. But it is doing what it has to do. I feel like I want to get, like, a paint job on this thing, though. Maybe some fucking window tint, because this shit's looking stock as fuck. Almost like rental car stock, even though I don't think they would have any 5.0 GTs for rental cars. But I don't know. I might be mistaken. Let's see how fast I can get it. Oh, is that a speed challenge? Oh, not going to be good. All right, we're good. Dude, we just fucking shit on that motherfucker. Just went straight through his car in a fucking Mustang. 186. That was as good as the Hellcat right there. Like, it, it wasn't even that bad at all. That was actually tremendously good. There was fucking loot there. Son of a bitch, man. Better not disappear on me. Oh, this thing actually turns relatively well. We just whipped that shit. What do we got? An upgrade? Oh, we got a part in stock. I feel like I should upgrade this a little. Just kind of see if it does any better. Don't honk at me prior. What the fuck? Especially as I'm pausing the game. Oh, yeah, we do have some... Holy shit in a nutshell. How often had I used this car without fucking... A? are you kidding me? This one's almost fully... What the fuck? You could tell this is what I used in, like, the, be the beginning and the start of the goddamn game and shit, dude. Like, what the fuck? 
That just goes to show I've never upgraded vehicles like I should have. This is almost there. Okay, well, that upgrade definitely did some stuff to this car. Let's, uh, oh, Becky, Jesus, she just wanted to go out and fucking walk. She got that all right. She got fucking walked over by a Mustang. Isn't that accurate for a car show? All right, uh, let's see if we can customize this thing just a wee bit. Again, wrong menu, because why not? Vehicles, customize. I want to throw some window tint on this. I also want to change the color. These are all factory colors right here, which all look decent, but... Ooh, that red looks gorgeous. Maybe we could do, like, a custom color. I don't know. I feel like the custom color that I'm... Whoa, shit. I didn't... Whoa! I did not know you can zoom in like that. That's fucking gorgeous, dude. Holy shit. Oof, a nice red. A red would look so fire. We'll get, like, black rims instead of, like, the metallic gray or the gunmetal gray that they have. Ooh. Ooh, I'm feeling it. Uh, let's see what we got. Let's let's get a visual parts here. We're gonna see if we can swap some of the... Ooh, get, like, a nice fucking hood. Something with a big-ass scoop and some vents and shit. Yeah, son. Okay, well, we're just gonna try the car the way it is. At least it's, like, switched up and different than it was before. So, oh my god, that looks so much better with the hood. Holy shit. I just wish the fucking rims could go black. It would be so much better. Oh my god. Holy shit. The rims and the fucking tires and fucking just the whole body style in general looks so much fucking better and it puts down the power. I definitely want to try this car in a race then. Let's see if I could beat my old one. 203. Man, we just crushed that shit and we were in the Mustang. I'm definitely eager to try this car in a race, dude definitely eager i wonder if i can find one quickly to be able to do it in just just for shits and giggles you know what i mean obviously we're gonna have to go out of seattle here because there's just no more races in seattle unfortunately so sacramento that's relatively close the seattle seattle to sacramento four minutes who would have thought uh let's see what else we got damn our map is so much more populated i love it oh shit new york is fucking popping with the uh oh shit i don't know if i've done these before though Midtown speed trap. That's not really what I want. Fucking A. All right, we get to use this. I think we're going to be going against someone. Oh, in a challenger, too. That's going to be interesting because that's pretty much the car we've been using the whole time. That's a much older model with a really shitty hood on it. But hey, you know what? It's fine. Whatever floats their boat. I think this is going to be a lot easier to use than the, uh, than the Hellcat just because I feel like we're going to have more grip to the ground and just better at pulling out of the turns if we do have to drift instead of it being like so sketchy oh god damn that echo made it sound like homie was right up on my left but he was nowhere near me it was just my car going off of the uh walls there oof we are doing good six second lead time on this guy we're 20 percent completed on this this is gonna be our race for sure and we're gonna take it home in the fucking mustang too which is kind of dope not gonna lie it would be cool to have one of these cars they uh are pretty fucking beautiful looking I feel like I would want mine in, like, some type of blue, though. Or even this orange would be cool. But then again, it, like, follows red too much. So I feel like it would just stand out to all the cops like a motherfucker. Which is why gray vehicles are really good. Because it's, like, neutral. And it kind of, like, sits in the middle of what they're looking for. Not like I'm out there fucking recklessly driving or anything. Just let's throw that out there. That way we don't have any bullshit. Uh, nine second lead time. 41% completed. I can't see a motherfucking thing leaving that tunnel there. God, our car sounds so good against these. I don't know if you guys are wearing uh, headsets, but if you are, you should be able to hear left to right channel audio, and you'd be able to hear that it's kind of like just popping up on the left-hand side of our car there. Oh, it just sounds so fucking good. Okay, 56% completed. We've been through this, so it's a, it's a two-lap race up in this. Uh, this is the second time we've been going through this one. I don't know where homie is on the map. Okay, we've got a huge lead. We've even made some fucking turns since uh, he's not even able to keep up so yeah this is this is pretty good so if we were to happen to fuck our shit up we have a 14 second lead time on this guy and i think that's plenty of fucking time to be able to 15 seconds i take it all back Oof. and we've been doing really good at keeping our shit in between and out of everything that we need to and i kind of feel like um those those challenges where we have to go and destruct everything and hit like the crates and the jumps that kind or the near misses uh, that's kind of like getting us to drive a little more precise, I think. So maybe it will help in the uh, end of the day. But just being able to dial down the handling lines in this goddamn game. Because they're so different. They are so different than every other game that I've played. Uh, be it, you know, fucking Grand Theft Auto or just any other racing game like Forza. They, this game seems to have its own little handling line feels going on like nobody's business. 
89% completed. Two minutes, 45 seconds on the clock. And we are like six blocks ahead of this other racer. So I definitely think we're going to be able to take this one. Oh, we are fucking taking these corners so well, dude. Pass the checkpoint, Here we go. Let's go. just hit it with the nitrous. Bang. That's Ooh, what I'm talking about. What do you mean? I, I, I had the lead time by like 20 seconds almost. Are you kidding me? That's some toxic bullshit right there. That was a fun little uh, little race track right there. I didn't mind that one. It was uh, simple, but still kind of felt good. And I was able to perform a lot of drifts kind of going around. I thought it just took them all and not just left some on the ground there. So that's always good to know. And then it's fucking raining when we get done. That's awesome. Oh, he going ham. I got to get that. Your stock is full. Scrap parts to make room. What? Oh, I think this is what someone fucking warned me about, dude. Someone was like, wait till Polecat realizes that he's about to be filled on uh, parts and shit. Son of a bitch. How do I clear parts? I don't know how to do that. Um, I, I, I have no idea how to do that at all. Wait a second. Is it under here? Hold on. Oh my god, I can scrap old ones? Oh shit. What the fuck? I didn't even know that that was a fucking thing, bro. I literally had no idea that that was a thing. That makes so much more sense now. Alright, let's, uh, let's max this car out a little bit more because we do have some new stuff here. Oh, that one's underneath too, what the fuck? Okay, well, now that I know that, I'm going to have to go through and we're going to have to scrap a whole bunch of shit here. What's pro settings? What the fuck? All that stuff what you just the scrapped, fuck? It just became spare parts. Okay. Combine them with bucks and you can rebuild the fixes you already have. What? You get to choose one of two new fixes or stick with your original. But either way, the money and spare parts will be spent. So, like the old guy in that movie said, choose, but choose wisely. I, I'm going to have to look up a YouTube video on what the fuck that was even supposed to mean. Because I just don't even understand that at all in any way, shape, or form. Uh, but that's interesting. So, I, if, if you guys can explain that to me, please be my guest. Because that would be something I'm eager to know. I could also look up on a YouTube video and kind of fuse them all together. Uh, and kind of put like a general consensus of what the fuck I should be doing. Also, if someone can explain the performance level and why some stuff gets locked out... Like, I can't fucking upgrade it for some reason. That just doesn't make any sense to me. Uh, this is kind of like the only part of this game that I don't understand. I understand the racing and the driving. It's when it comes to the customization of the vehicle, it totally just escapes my mind. Uh, my stock is full. Scrap parts to make room. I did, though. What do you mean? Okay, well, we're going to have to lose out on this loot here, unfortunately. You guys are going to have to give me some lowdown on what the fuck it's trying to tell me. Uh, but that's going to be where we wrap up this episode, ladies and gentlemen, with the crew, too, getting in here, actually doing very well. I enjoyed all the races that we were in, and that's all that matters in the end of the day. So thank you all so much for watching this episode of The Crew, too, and we will see you next video.